All right, the month of October has her wearing a costume every day of the month, not just on Halloween, and she has something very special planned for the big day. Molly Reels in Roseville to give us the details this morning. Hey, Molly. Yeah, I'll tell you what, she goes all out for Halloween. Check out her house. Oh, Han Solo, I love you. And he knows, <laughs> but that pales in comparison. <laughs> uh, pales in comparison to how much Shannon loves Halloween. So first, just the decor of her home. She picks a different theme every year for her house. Clearly, it's Star Wars. Uh, even has a Chewbacca couch. But Hilarious. as you said, John, every single day of the month, she wears a different costume. So what will she show up to work in today? Mars attacks. Okay, Shannon. No, that's not Shannon. That is Shannon. There she oh is in full character. <laughs> Shannon, everybody. Okay, so we are day Shannon 29. That means you have worn 29 costumes so far yeah. this month. I only have two more days to go. Yeah. And I asked you earlier uh, how long you've been doing this. You said for basically your whole life, you've mm -hmm. worn a different costume for 10 to 15 days. And then uh, starting about five years ago, you made it every single day for work. Yes, I got a challenge from one of my coworkers, Naomi. And she said, why don't you just do every day? Because I do like 15, 20 days <laughs> and well. every holiday, mm -hmm. you know, so. Um, and I'm like, okay. And so since then, everybody is going, oh, I can't wait for your Halloween. I'm like, oh, great. <laughs> I know. You deserve a vacation the afterwards. Pressure. So let's come see where she stores all of those costumes. And she even walks in character. Look, she's been studying the role, guys. She really <laughs> dedicates it. So, funny. so here is your costume closet, if you will. Yeah. Uh, you made this dress. This is Effie from Hunger Games? Yes, yes, yes. Wow. That's like, oh. she is an icon. I love all of her clothes from, I would wear that to work every day, like all of her clothes, but yeah. it's a little bit harder to put together and a little bit uncomfortable. I glued them all on, as you can oh see. Oh my I have gosh. glue coming out everywhere. Um, so here's my hat. Wow. It's beautiful. Uh, but as we look through, too, you said sometimes you make it easy on yourself. Uh, for ex but so creative. Look at this. To toilet yeah. paper rolls for a wig? Yes. <laughs> um, actually, yes. And this is, I was trash. I was a trashy aristocrat. Um, I don't know. I trashy put a whole bunch of garbage bags, and it actually turned out pretty cool. Uh, so oh she has gosh. a vision board. Take a look at this. So these, this is a vision board of everything she was <laughs> look at uh, for Halloween Brady so dancer. far this year. Uh -huh. uh, she has she has Alice from Brady Bunch, but you were every character from yes. the Brady Bunch. And then I did a whole Brady Bunch oh, thing. You know, it was that. the exact same thing. Mugatu um, from Zoolander. And if you guys want to see how accurate she was with Effie, this was the inspiration. Look at that. <laughs> Oh, nice. Wow. Elfie, Elfie. I said it wrong. Um, okay, you're unbelievable. <laughs> no, I misspelled it. <laughs> oh, you misspelled it. Okay, there we go. So here's the thing. She is in good company in her neighborhood. She has a neighbor just a few houses down who does what she does, different costume every day, except different decorations. So she has a skeleton oh theme gosh. every single day. It's a different mm -hmm. theme for the skeletons. Yeah. So oh, we're going to take a little work. field trip and see those decorations it's coming exciting. up. <laughs> Maybe I'll borrow a costume. Oh my gosh. Yes, absolutely. Okay. I have a thousand. <laughs> she, she has some to spare. Maybe I'll be a spare. trashy aristocrat. <laughs> um, so we'll see you guys soon. We love Shannon. Um, oh. Julissa Ortiz introduced us to Shannon some years ago. And so now this is like the mm -hmm. thing. Like we want to... Yeah. Every year we have to see oh, what she does. One so, of one of our favorite traditions is visiting so, you, Shannon. So we're now one of the yeah, yeah. Thank thank you. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. thank, thank you, Shannon. Sure. Love you. Good day, Sacramento. Everybody meet Shannon if you haven't. Shannon is the Halloween queen. She has dressed up for Halloween every single day during the month of October. It is her yearly tradition. Uh, so I thought I would raid her closet, see if I could find a Halloween costume for myself. So everybody introducing Reagan. Oh, my. Wait. <laughs> Wait. No, she didn't. Uh, no. <laughs> Molly, Molly, wait! Oh, go, 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 Molly! Why are you better than her? Yeah. Why? That was good. Am I officially an Olympic athlete? 
that would have scored better than it zero points. It would have scored better zero. than Reagan. Yeah. Yes. Go uh, Molly. Uh, Go uh. Molly. <laughs> Wait. Yes. Yes. Best part right there. Right there. <laughs> That's good for your abs. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, Molly Real. Yes, yes ma'am. That was good. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Good stuff. Good. Nailed it. Oh, I gotta be How many here. bruises do I have? Oh, boy. Probably a few. But I feel like it was worth it. She took like her shoes off and everything. She was committed. <laughs> she was committed. <laughs> Where did you get the sweatsuit? <laughs> oh. Why gosh. the actual Team Australia? So Where do you good. think I got it? <laughs> so good. Oh. Shannon, you have to get, no matter what you ever get rid of, don't get rid of that sweatsuit. I yeah, that, that was fantastic. Good. Thank you, Molly. For be my show today. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, instant replay. <laughs> <laughs> so fun. How, do, how does she know so much of the I ray gun know. routine? She, she nails it, too. Yeah. Oh, man. Molly Real. By the way, do we owe money to the Olympic Committee for doing that? <laughs> No, because Molly did it better than Reagan. Yes, yeah, she did. Yeah. They owe us money. <laughs> oh, NB gosh. Is NBC going to come after us? <laughs> no. <laughs> I mean, what is the name for that? For that move? Well, hey, what do you call that? We should come up with something. I don't know. Floor Angel? No, the kangaroo was the... Uh... So, oh, Starfish. <laughs> That's right. Kangaroo was... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that, was star that was Starfish. Mm -hmm. That's so sad. That she even was able to do that at the Olympics. Oh, gosh. Mama always said Halloween was like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get, especially in this neighborhood. Hey, welcome back to Good Day Sacramento. I'm Ray Gunn a.k.a. Molly Real. Uh, earlier in the show, we introduced you to Shannon, the queen of Halloween. She, for the past five years, has dressed up in a different costume, including this one, every single day in the month of October. Uh, well, just so happens, she has a neighbor who is equally in the spirit of Halloween. Claudette is, lives here, and every single day in October, her skeletons are dressed in a different theme. Talk about dedication. Okay, so today we've got Back to the Future. We have Forrest Gump over there. We've got E.T. and Elliot riding away. So Claudette, 90s movies today. Today is 90s movies. It's day 29. And um, yeah, we have a little vignette of some 90s movies today. Are you tired? I'm tired. I'm not going <laughs> to lie. I'm tired. So you said you've, you've always decorated. You've always gone all out for holidays, but uh, your kids went away to college. You started this last year doing a different theme every day. This is your empty nest uh, syndrome. My, yes, exactly. I, I, there's worse things I'm, I'm, I'm imagining, but uh, yeah, no, it's fun. It's, it's a lot of fun. The neighbors seem to love it. And you know, people stop by and just say how much their kids love it or their grandkids or, you know, they'll be having a bad day and they'll drive by and it puts a smile on their face. And that is worth all the blood, sweat and tears. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's something to look forward to. Now, let's bring in Shannon. And this is her daughter, Amelie, who has also gotten into the spirit of Halloween. Now, the two of you aren't just uh, Halloween fanatics, we'll call it, in your own right. But you do a lot of swapsies, too. Okay. Like you were Elliot the other day. Yep. Yep. About a couple weeks ago. Uh -huh. And I borrowed her bike for which thing that I was riding. And so, yes, we both just kind of at night, it's 10 o'clock. I don't know what to be tomorrow. I don't know what to do with my skeletons. And so we just kind of collaborate. We <laughs> then we come up look with for that. inspiration from each other, for sure. A hundred percent. Like that's her son's skateboard. <laughs> um, that's her, one of her, wi or that, oh, sorry, that's Amelie's skateboard. skateboard. That wig that's on uh, Marty McFly is hers. Um, what else? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. We just share and. and you share. had Ray Gun too. Oh, yeah, Ray Gun was out here the other day. Uh, for sure. But whose moves were better? Yours, 100%. Okay. <laughs> Reagan didn't move a whole lot. <laughs> Get it. Uh. All right. Yes. Well, you know what they say? The neighborhood that Halloween's together stays together. Uh, yeah. You guys are winning it. Thank you so much for sharing your spirit with us. And with that, I'm trying to think of. Don't do it on the ground. Not on the asphalt. No, not it's not the worth asphalt. it. It's not, girl, <laughs> the strawberry is not worth it. You can do the, you can do the kangaroo hop. The... <laughs> there it is. There it is. There you go. 
I'll catch you later. <laughs> she hops off screen. <laughs> so then good. Back off.